Welcome back everyone, it's Baz again with another video from World of Warships Legends. And here we are today doing a video guide for the ultimate arsonist trophy or achievement. You unlock it for sinking a ship while doing at least 50% burning damage to it. And you saw at the beginning there I had to deal with the rambunctious V170 for the first 5 minutes of the match, but he was just our appetizer. The Kaiser behind them is going to be our main course for this trophy and achievement. I'm in the Orion, the British Tier 3 battleship. A Tier 3 is actually the best fire starting battleship, and as battleships are the highest fire starting class of ship, that makes it the highest fire starter at the tier altogether. But for the most part, ship selection won't matter too much because this trophy will require a lot of luck. If you're new to the game, this is how it works. Burning damage only accrues if you start a fire on a ship and it continues to burn. That means that your opponent either chooses not to damage con it, or that they can't because the damage con is on cooldown, meaning they've already used it recently. Any damage done from the impact of your shells does not count. Another way of putting it is that only the damage in between your shots counts. And of course, only high explosive shells can cause fires. Now, I've had this Kaiser burning for most of this clip. My very first shot on the Kaiser caused two fires and they stuck which was a great start. You can see the damage ticking away in the top right corner there. This clip was from a match at around the time I started first playing the game, so I wasn't actually going for this trophy purposely. The best way to get this trophy is to simply not think about it. You will get it by luck eventually, but more often than not you'll get it at lower tiers where other players are still trying to learn the game and who are not sure how to use their damage gun properly. Now the most infuriating part of this trophy is that you can get the in-game medal, but not the trophy, because the medal only requires you to get 40% burning damage, not 50% like the trophy asks you to do. So if you didn't happen to know that, you may be screaming at your TV when you see the medal pop up on the screen, and we're anticipating the trophy to follow shortly, but then it doesn't. So keep that in mind. Now at the beginning of this match, my team oddly abandoned me, so I was forced into a kiting position due to the torpedo threat of that destroyer. If you look at the mini-map, there are some big islands in between the Kaiser and the rest of my teammates, which prevent them from helping me as well. That actually turns out to be a good thing, because they may have taken some of the damage away that I needed to get that 50% burning damage for the trophy. Slam the brakes back there, because I didn't want to lose him by going behind the island right before I'm about to finish him off, thus losing out on the kill. Looks like he's using a heal to keep himself alive there at the last minute. The most frustrating part of this trophy is that you have to be the one to get the killing blow for it to count. If someone yoinks the kill from you, which one of my teammates almost did from me there, it won't count. And that's the medal and trophy we were going for. Here's a screenshot of the trophy since the PS4 doesn't capture trophies popping during video capture without a capture card. If you have any questions about the trophy slash achievement, or have any comments, please put them down below. I hope this short video does help you out, and if you did like it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of my videos, hit that subscribe button, and as always, stay healthy and do what makes you happy.